So you might be in a situation where you want to go ahead and remove the Pegasus spyware on your iPhone just in case you have it. Now there's a couple of things you can do. The main way to go ahead and basically fix this for the most part is to factory reset your iPhone. So that does mean it's going to delete everything off your phone. So just go through, back up everything you can possibly back up on your phone. Photos, videos, everything like that. Make multiple backups because it's going to delete everything from your phone. Then when you're ready, you can make your way over to your settings application. Go into your general settings, which is right here. Scroll down into transfer reset iPhone. Click on erase all constant as settings and then basically just go through and erase that iPhone. That's one of the main things you can do. And that is kind of one way to go and fix this. Now, another thing you can kind of do on top of that is if you don't want to reset your phone, you can just, you know, restart your phone and see if that ends up fixing it. So go ahead and just hold down the buttons you normally would to restart your phone, slide the power off, and you want to kind of see if that ends up fixing the problem, which for some people it might, for others it might not, but most of the time it's probably not going to fix it. If, uh, you know, you don't want to do that, you do have another option of basically going through and putting your phone into lockdown mode. Now what this does is it's going to go through and basically just kind of put your phone into a more secure environment and it's going to limit your phone like crazy, but you can go ahead and basically make your way over to your iPhone settings and type in lockdown and you should be able to see this lockdown mode option come up. So go and click on lockdown mode and all you're going to want to do here is you want to go and click on turn on lockdown mode. So what this is going to do is it's going to limit and basically restrict your phone like crazy, but it is going to make your iPhone way more secure. So if you're like a politician, or if you're like some famous important person, putting your phone into lockdown mode could be a smart thing to do if your phone is being targeted. So those are basically the main ways and main things to do. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so then.